So this Insta lecture would be on medulloblastoma. And the first key concept that I would like to tell you about medulloblastoma is this is the most common malignant brain tumor seen in children. This is the most common primary brain cancer seen in children. The most common benign, the low-grade neoplasm which is seen in children, benign tumor seen in children is pilocytic astrocytoma. Pilocytic astrocytoma is grade 1 out of grade maximum grade 4 possible. On the contrary, medulloblastoma is the grade 4 out of grade 4, maximum grade 4. So, Medulloblastoma is the most common malignant brain tumor, the, the most common primary brain cancer seen in children and is WHO grade 4, the maximum grade possible. The second concept that I'd like to tell on medulloblastoma that used, usually arises exclusively from cerebellum. It's a cerebellar origin brain tumor. And in the childhood, it typically arises from the midline of the cerebellum, which can be seen in the MRI. Now, the next big concept of medulloblastoma that their presentation is with raised intracranial pressure, just like any other brain tumor, and also it can present with features of cerebellar dysfunction because they are originating from the cerebellum. The fourth key concept about medulloblastoma that, on morphologically, that you usually present with features of seeds of anaplastic tumor cells which has very scant, very little amount of cytoplasm. Mostly the cells are made with a nucleus. That's, that's, that's why they look like bluish, the tumor cells like blue round cells. And there will be presence of features of the homerite pseudo rosettes. There will be presence of features of necrosis also. And the last key concept that I'd like to tell about medulloblastoma that usually shows association with, with Gorlin syndrome and a variant of family adenomatous polyposis syndrome that is Tarcot syndrome, T-U-R-C-O-T, and Gorlin, G-O-R-L-I-N, Gorlin syndrome. So these are the all key concepts that you need to know about medulloblastoma in a nutshell. It's a childhood brain tumor, typically addresses from five to nine years of age. And it's quite rare after 40, actually. You should not make a diagnosis of medulloblastoma after 40 years, typically. Uh, it's the most common malignant brain tumor arising from the brain. It arises exclusively from the cerebellum. It shows association with Tarcot syndrome and Gorlin syndrome. And medulloblastoma, morphologically, they show features of uh, seeds of anaplastic tumor cells with presence of homorite pseudorus. The other key concepts of the medulloblastoma I will discuss in the second part. Thank you very much.